Hey everyone, welcome back to Mechanical Special. In today's video, we are going to discuss the symptoms and causes of vacuum leaks. But before we jump in, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell. So you never miss out on our helpful automotive content. Let's get started. Engine vacuum plays a role in maintaining the proper air-fuel mixture within the combustion chambers. The vacuum in the intake manifold is created by the engine's pistons moving downward. During the intake stroke, a pressure differential is created that draws air into the combustion chambers. Symptoms of vacuum leak 1. Rough idling A vacuum leak can disrupt the balance between air and fuel entering the engine, leading to an improper air-fuel mixture. This imbalance causes the engine to run unevenly, resulting in a rough or shaky idle. 2. Poor acceleration A vacuum leak can result in a lack of power during acceleration. The engine may feel sluggish, and you might notice a decrease in overall performance. This can be particularly noticeable when you press the accelerator pedal, and the engine doesn't respond as promptly or forcefully as it should. 3. Stalling In more severe cases of vacuum leaks, the disruption to the air-fuel mixture can become significant enough to cause the engine to stall. Stalling occurs when the engine fails to maintain a stable combustion process, leading to a sudden shutdown. 4. Check engine light The ECM monitors various engine parameters, including the air-fuel mixture. When a vacuum leak is detected, the ECM illuminates the check engine light to alert the driver to a potential issue. 5. High idle speed A vacuum leak can allow excess air to enter the engine, causing the idle speed to increase. The ECM attempts to adjust the idle speed to compensate for the extra air, but if the leak is significant, the engine may idle at a higher than normal speed. 6. Hissing or whistling sounds The sound of hissing or whistling is often associated with air escaping from the vacuum leak. The leak may occur in vacuum hoses, intake manifold gaskets, or other components of the air intake system. 7. Poor fuel efficiency With an incorrect air-fuel mixture, the engine operates less efficiently, resulting in decreased fuel efficiency. The engine may burn more fuel than necessary, leading to lower miles per gallon and increased fuel consumption. 8. Engine misfire A vacuum leak can disrupt the air-fuel mixture, leading to incomplete combustion in one or more cylinders. This can result in an engine misfire, characterized by a noticeable stuttering or jerking sensation while driving. 9. Hard starting the disrupted air-fuel ratio due to a vacuum leak may make it challenging for the engine to start, especially in certain conditions. It can lead to extended cranking times before the engine successfully starts. 10. Unusual smells from exhaust. Incomplete combustion caused by a vacuum leak can produce unusual smells from the exhaust, such as a strong odor of unburned fuel. This can be an indication of inefficient fuel combustion. Let's discuss the causes of vacuum leaks. 1. Worn or cracked vacuum hoses. Over time, rubber vacuum hoses can become brittle, cracked, or develop leaks. Exposure to heat, oil, and other environmental factors can contribute to the degradation of the hose material. 2. Loose or disconnected hoses. Hoses can become disconnected or loosened from their fittings, either accidentally or due to vibrations over time. This can lead to a loss of vacuum pressure. 3. Faulty Intake Manifold Gasket The intake manifold gasket seals the connection between the intake manifold and the engine block. If the gasket deteriorates or develops a leak, it can allow unmetered air to enter the engine. This leads to a vacuum leak. 4. Damaged Throttle Body Gasket The throttle body gasket seals the connection between the throttle body and the intake manifold. If the gasket is damaged or cracked, it can allow air to enter the system, causing a vacuum leak. 5. Bad PCV Valve 
The PCV valve regulates the flow of crankcase gases into the intake manifold. If the PCV valve malfunctions, it can either allow too much or too little airflow, leading to a disruption in the vacuum system. 6. Faulty EGR valve. The EGR valve allows a controlled amount of exhaust gases to enter the intake manifold. If the valve is stuck open, it introduces excess air into the system, causing a vacuum leak.